Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a military drum from the American Revolution. I'm going to just put a dot right there towards the left and over here I'm going to put another dot on the right. I go back to the left dot and I'm going to draw a little curve line up on the right, come back to the dot, little curve line up on the left. I'm going to do the same thing on the right side. Come to the dot, curve line up, go back to the dot, curve line up again. Now I come back to the open section and I draw a straight diagonal up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. And I come on the left hand side, I draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. Now we're going to be doing some overlaps, so watch what I do. Starting right here at this section, I'm going to draw a curved line all the way over, straight line, curved line, jump over, curved line, connect. Now I'm going to come down and draw straight curved line, straight curved line on the left and the right. Go back to the left, bring it over, connect. I'm going to come back up to the inside and I'm just going to draw a curve line, straight line, curve line, jump over, straight line, connect. Now I'm going to do a series of two straight lines. So I go one, two, one, two, I'm working my way around. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Keep going. One, two, one, two, one, two. And I can fit one more here. One, two. Now I come back down on the left and I draw a straight line down on the left straight line down on the right. Go back to the left and connect the two with a slightly curved line. Come back to the left, straight line, right, straight line, connect the two. One more time on the left, straight line, on the right, straight line, connect the two. If you run out of room, that's okay. All right. Now I come back up on top and these little double lines, I'm going to continue them. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, maybe a little one right there. From the lines, the double lines, I'm going to come up and I'm going to put a straight line down, then a straight line up. Straight line down, straight line up, straight line down, straight line up, whoops, straight line down. Now I'm going to mimic those lines. Come in skinny mini, straight line up, straight line down, straight line up, straight line down, straight line up, straight line down. And if you can fit it in, straight line up, straight line down. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Now this looks a little confusing because you have all these lines, so let's try and straighten some of them out with color. These are your drumsticks, so let's color these brown. Okay, the inside part of your drum, if you have a peach or an apricot or a light color, color that in that color. If you don't, just use your brown lightly. So that gives you the surface of your drum. Then all those double lines, these are the brackets that held the 
drum together. I'm making mine yellow. They're usually a gold or a brass. That's to secure the top to the bottom. So let's go ahead and make those, those color. Now you can kind of see a little bit better where you're going. I'm going to come down here to the bottom and I'm going to make this section brown because they had to have a strong base. So that'll be brown. And now if you have gray, I'm going to come in and do the bottom bottom section gray. And I'm going to come up and I'm going to do this section in between the brass holdings which were yellow. We're going to do this all gray. Now the more you color, the more you can actually see what your drum looks like. So I'm going to make those all gray. Now I come in and these are the straps that kept everything all together and I'm going to make those black. Make sure you do every single one. All the way across. And everybody's drum is going to look different, just like this one is. And now, once I've done that, I come in and I color the inside section of the drum red. All of these shapes in here should be red. You might go, what? No, this should all look recognizable when you get it all done. Okay, let's see what it does look like finished, colored in. Here's my drum, all colored in, ready for battle. The drum corps was very important in the American Revolution. This uh, kept everybody in march, in time, for troops to move forward. Okay, bye-bye.